I'm going to show you the top three supplements that you want to take if you're in boxing, if you're in MMA, or any other sport, matter of fact. And all these supplements, uh, you probably heard of them. Uh, they're very popular. But here's the thing, man. These are all going to work. They're going to get you results. And uh, you might want to try them out because they work. The first one is going to be caffeine. Now, the thing about caffeine is... Uh, gives you a lot of focus uh, it increases your strength a little bit and by the way i'm not going to give you any numbers because i'm not a fucking scientist so do your own research find out how these supplements will help you but i'm telling you right now these do work get them they're very cheap first one is caffeine again caffeine the best way to take caffeine in my opinion is to drink coffee because people who drink coffee uh they found out that they have a lot more testosterone levels they live longer they're healthier do your research on it i'm telling you this is true the second one is going to be citrulline now the thing about citrulline is citrulline helps you train more the reason it helps you train more is because it, it helps you recover faster that means if you go into the gym matter of fact people who go to the gym and they take citrulline they recover up to one or two days faster than those that do not take citrulline. They've done this in a laboratory. It works. It helps you recover faster. If you can recover faster, you can train more often. If you can train more often, you can become sharper, better, faster than all your competitors. So that's why if you haven't taken any supplements, if you don't believe in supplements, bullshit, man. You should start to look into it, especially if you already, if you passed the beginner phase where, you know, now you, you, you know all the boxing basics, you know, all the, you know, you've, You've gotten to a level where, you know, your your improvement is not as quick. You're not improving as fast. You definitely want to get into supplements, man, because it's all about these small percentages, and that's what adds up, man. So if you don't believe in supplements, you believe in this whole vegan shit that's going on and all that stuff, I'm telling you, man, you should get into supplements. At least try it out because you will see results. You'll recover faster. You'll perform better in the gym. The third supplement that we're going to be talking about is going to be creatine. Now, a quick disclaimer about creatine. If you've got a fight in a few weeks or a few months, or if, you know, if you're fighting and if you're, trying to, uh, if you're trying to weigh in at a certain weight limit, creatine is probably not going to be for you. The reason that is is because it adds a lot of water weight. And uh, the thing with creatine, though, is if, you know, if you're off-season and you're trying to add some strength, add some power, it's one of the most effective supplements that you can take. It's old school. It's been around for a very long time. It's very well researched. One of the most researched supplements that's proven to work. Matter of fact, 90% of people who take creatine, they get stronger. And they can recover faster. And they can do more weights in the gym. And they can. that means they can punch harder. They can be more explosive. So you probably should take it, man. So yeah, creatine, man. Creatine. So how do you take creatine? You just take it post-workout because that's the best time to take it. Now, mostly it's in a lot of pre-workouts and that's fine. That's fine. But it's been proven that people who take creatine post-workout, they get better results. So take it post-workout. And if you guys want to look into how much these supplements cost and, you know, check them out. The best place to do so is probably going to be Amazon. They're all there. You don't have to go to some fucking sketchy supplement website selling you their fucking flashy neon colored supplement that costs $50. That's probably worth $2 from China. They're drop shipping it. So you want to go with something legit like bulk supplements. Uh, the packaging doesn't look as colorful, but the results are still the same. It's the same fucking ingredients. So bulk supplements, I've got the links down in the description if you guys want to check it out. And I'm telling you, man, if you try, if you take these supplements today, if you combine, if you take caffeine pre-workout, when you leave the gym, you take citrulline and you take, oh, you, you, you could take citrulline pre and post-workout, but yeah, you could, if you take caffeine and citrulline pre-workout and post-workout, you take your uh, citrulline and creatine, I guarantee you, I fucking guarantee you, man, you're going to get results faster. You're going to notice that you're going to recover faster and you're, you know, Everything, everything's going to be just better because you got improved blood flow, you got improved strength, and you got increased focus from caffeine. So combining these three together, that might have been your question. Can you combine these three together? Absolutely. Matter of fact, most pre-workouts, they combine these three together, but they cost you a fortune. So if you buy them separately and you do your own mixing, 
you're gonna save a lot of money. So check it out. I just showed you three supplements that will help improve your game for 2020. So take action and get them right now.